We just got this huge bass on there. It's not huge, but it's a decent bass, that's for sure. There's a bit of spider off the surface we tied a little bit ago. It's a nice bass. L little one's chasing it also. Wondering what's going on. Another bass, maybe we can catch that one. Yeah, let's try it. <laughs> right in the face. As you can and see, that's a pretty good bass, I guess. It's a decent bass. It's not the and biggest. You can see the uh, swallowed that fly you know, partly in. See if we can get the other one now. Uh, I don't know where he is. He swam off to the right, so. Yeah. So yeah, far, a good and, day. Right, hit it off the surface. So that's pretty cool. Wasn't expecting that. <laughs> see if we can get it back in there and catch something. Wrap around the pole. Get back away from that. Yeah, spider fly pretty much works for anything. I've caught crappies on it too when they're they feed off the surface. And um, sunfish, a lot of sunfish. Boogie. Big one way over there in those weeds. Big sunfish. Big one. I don't call it. So we can get over there without scaring him. There's a little one down here we can try to catch it. Just to see. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there you go. Little sunfish. There you go. Spider fly like Tidy yesterday. Pretty good. We can get another fish on here. Then I'll try like a sinking fly or something. Something like a wet fly. We don't catch any in a couple casts here. It's kind of slow to it. Usually it's, it's a lot better than this, but. There's a bass and a big sunfish over there. Yeah, let's try over here in these weeds. The red thing on when you tie it on makes it a lot a lot easier to see from farther away. Just tie that little piece of red foam on it.
little bass over there. Coming out of the weeds here. Try to catch that nice sunfish. It's a big sunfish over there. I'll get stuck in the weeds. Right on top of them. 